There is a great variety of plant and other species in India due to climate and relief differences. The monsoon forests, however, form the dominant vegetation type in this region. In this chapter, we will study the following concepts. Types of natural vegetation Excluding the mountain forests found in the Himalayan region, the natural vegetation of India is classified into four main categories. Tropical rainforests, Tropical deciduous forests, Thorny forests, and Tidal forests. Tropical rainforests. These forests have evergreen trees. These trees do not have any particular season for shedding their leaves. This region receives heavy rainfall of more than 200 centimeters in a year. These forests are found on the rainy slopes of Western Ghats, Orissa, the northeastern states, as well as Andaman and Nicobar Islands. Commercially important trees include mahogany, ebony, rosewood, sal, and teak. Tropical deciduous forests. These forests have trees which shed their leaves during a particular season. In order to conserve their moisture, the trees shed their leaves in the dry season. Fresh leaves begin to grow with the onset of rainy season. These forests are therefore also called monsoon forests. The trees are divided into two types, dry and moist deciduous. The moist deciduous type is found on the eastern slopes of the western ghats. In Chhattisgarh region, Jharkhand, and the Shivaliks in the north. The dry deciduous ones are found in regions that get 50 cm to 100 cm rainfall. Teak is the most important tree of wet deciduous, while sal is an important tree of dry deciduous. Other important trees include sandalwood and babool. Thorny forests. These forests are found in areas having annual rainfall of less than 80 cm. Short trees like babool and kikar are found in these forests. Thorns are a sort of protection. They help trees to preserve moisture and discourage animals from eating them. Most trees have deep roots to reach underground water. Such forests are found in the dry parts of northwestern India like Rajasthan, Gujarat, the interior parts of peninsular India, mountain vegetation. On high mountains like the Himalayas, altitude, change in temperature and precipitation are important factors affecting the distribution of vegetation, right from the base up to the tree line. Most deciduous forests are found at the foothills of the Himalayas, a range called the Shivaliks. At a height of about 1,500 meters above sea level, evergreen forests are found. The trees here are mostly oak, pine, cheer, and chestnut. Between 2,000 to 3,300 meters above sea level, we mostly find cedar, fir, pine, deodar, and silver fir trees. Alpine vegetation of shrubs and grasses are found beyond a height of 3,600 meters above sea level. Tidal forests. These are mangrove forests. They are called Sundarbans in West Bengal. This name is derived from the Sundri trees that are found in abundance in these forests. Sundri trees provide durable wood, which is good for making boats. Mangrove trees can survive in both fresh and salt water. Besides West Bengal, these forests are also found in the delta regions of Ganga, Mahanadi, Godavari, Krishna and Kaveri.